Hey everybody, Kevin here, aka Program, and today I bring you a very special Let's Play. This game is uh, something I grew up with as a child, and I spent many hours playing, uh, you know, living my lifelong fantasy to own my own theme park. Now, mostly I played it because it was fun to create ridiculous things that would never exist in reality, and I was able to kill people on roller coasters, so... Yeah, I guess that makes me kind of a messed, messed up child, maybe deranged in the head, but you know what, let's not even talk about that much. But anyway, yeah, so I uh, found this on Steam uh, during the summer sale for like $2, so I had to pick it up, and I thought it would be fun to do a little let's play on it. Um, I'm probably just going to pick one of these and just start up on it. I might only do a couple episodes of this until we reach the objective on one of these but if you want to see more of me playing this then by all means let me know and I will be more than happy to oblige you because yeah I, I love this game it's been a long time since I played it so yeah let's go ahead and just jump into one okay to liberate wealth from the rich and distribute it to the needy you and your merry men have decided to build a theme park in Sh Sherwood Forest. To achieve a monthly income from the ride, tickets of at least a thousand dollars is our objective. So we're like Robin Hood? Yeah, and <laughs> so we just decide to make a theme park pretty much in the Amazon. You know, whatever. Sherwood Forest, whatever. But yeah, so uh, we don't have much to work with right now, but we are, like I said, we have to get a monthly income of a thousand dollars from ticket sales. So I think that shouldn't be too hard to do. And if you've never played this game, probably because, you know, you're, this game was kind of obsolete when you were you know, growing up, I strongly suggest playing it. Yes, it is out, out of date, you know, outdated graphics-wise and pretty much everything, but it can still run, or you can pick it up on Steam, and yeah, this, it's, it's a, it's a fun game. There's a lot that goes into it as well. If you can get past the outdated graphics. Okay, let's go ahead and um, start by looking at what our rides are doing at the moment. There's still only a dollar for admission, so we can go one of two routes. One being jack up the prices of everything, which means we don't have to make this place as big. Or we can be very generous and keep things really low and just build a lot of stuff hoping we would attract people. You know what, I don't want to be a money hungry person, so I'm going to keep things low. The Phil Swirl Dev looks like a good price for it. Let's see what the coaster is. $2. Hmm, I guess it's like go $2.50 because that's our prize attraction at the moment. And okay, you'll learn if we do this let's play for a while that I am big about theming and making things look cool. So let's go ahead and switch this stuff. Um, yeah, that's better. Let's get right in the middle. Um, yeah, that looks a lot better. Log cabin? Nah, I don't want log cabin. Castle. Hmm. Let's do a jungle entrance. Yeah, there we go. That fits more with the decor of everything at the moment. So let's go log cabin for everything. Or jungle entrance. Okay, we have jungle, main color scheme, alternate. Yeah, I like that a lot better. Um, oh, so I guess we can't change what's already been made. Maybe if we close it and try? No, so I just pissed people off. Okay. Sorry guys. Sorry for the confusion. I apologize. Okay, so this is profit minus $49 per hour. Yeah, that's not good. Uh, let's see what this is getting. Okay, total profit. 
Oh yeah, so we're getting a lot so, from this bad boy, so we're gonna keep that going. Um, I might go back and rename things later. If you guys have any ideas for names on stuff, let me know and I'll, I'll name it the way you want it, Richard. Uh, but let's go and change the name of our... It's been so long since I played, so this is me learning the game again as I go. Go screen first. Very original, I know. <laughs> okay, so we're just keeping it right there. And I'm thinking we need some more... Well, do we have any janitors? So we only have two. We might want two more. It's gonna eat our budget a bit, but that's okay. I'd rather cleanliness and preparedness to outweigh how much money we have, because the better our park, the more people we will attract later. Okay, so we're gonna. Yeah, we have a panda and a monkey, so that's good. And let's go one more security guard for now. And the next thing I want to do is probably build some food stands. I think we have something going on here. And what, these are really generic looking. I don't like the way these look. Can we change? No. So lemonade stand and we have a coffee, coffee apple market. Okay, so I think we're going to keep everything the way it is now. That's fine. We have plenty of seats. And we have some trash cans, so that's good. So let's go to start building off over here. And again, I do want to know I haven't played this game, I want to say since like the beginning of high school or longer than that, so bear with me if I make any, make any mistakes as I'm playing. Okay, so we have 9,000 gold, or money, dollars, <laughs> can't speak. Okay, so we're just going to keep that very simple. Uh, let's add some, some decor, make it look cool. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we'll do that. Okay. The one thing I didn't want to mention is this game, for how old it is, it runs really well. And if you really think about it, every single one of these people are, have their own AI, they, they do their own things, and they were all programmed, you know, separately. And just how much is going on on the screen at one time is pretty staggering for how old it is and there's no loading times it ran very well back then too and i'm surprised it's still running well on windows 8 to be honest because most older games don't hold well or don't fare pretty well so well there's a lot you can do okay i forgot how i mean i was younger so i didn't really mess with too much stuff back then this is pretty interesting robin hood type i think this is very fitting for the reason for this park being built. So let's go ahead and we can put this right here and kind of build around it. That's kind of cool. Oh. Okay, and then we're gonna build this on here. This might be too much, but you know what? It's cool. It's okay. Oh, we're gonna run to take that out. You'll see what I'm doing in a second. Okay. And we will... Yeah, we'll keep this right here though. Seems like it fits well. Because we can go all the way around. 
Okay, that works. And then we're gonna build food and such over here. Oh, we get a lot of stuff to sell that works. That's good. So we're gonna get some burgers because everybody makes burgers. Let's start that right there. I don't know why, I don't know why things don't um, start open. I mean, I understand like rights and stuff, but with this, I don't know. I feel like they should. Um, of course. And I hope everyone gets that reference. If not, then um, Good Burger should be on Netflix. I urge you to watch it. It's, it's a classic. <laughs> um, okay, we need some soda. Okay, so we're just gonna open that. How much is 120? Nah. Uh, if uh, some fast food places can have uh, drinks for a dollar, we're gonna have drinks for a dollar too. We're not gonna be one of those amusement parks that makes drinks five but six dollars and that's uh, yeah i'm good if we're making money we're gonna do it the right way guys okay so we have the info hut okay okay all that stuff goes around so that's good info hut 60 cents and dollar price okay yeah people want dollars you know what i'm gonna actually open this up now since it is raining and i'm sure people want it. No, oh, no, no. I think people want to be dry at this point. No. Okay. So we're gonna do that. Okay, so we're gonna go just like that. And oh, I think we have to go. Oh, okay. We're gonna get this. I promise. There we go. Uh-huh. That's how it looks. Okay, that's good. Okay, so we gotta build this over here. And do you want other stuff? What else do we want here? Um, let's go first aid. I think the first aid place is pretty important. Um, we're gonna probably want a place for them to do their business, so restroom. Let's go to restaurants. Just because we uh, consider it like that. Okay, so we'll do two restaurants. Let me make sure everything is open. So yes. Okay, so. And I think the, the most ridiculous thing is the fact that you can charge for people to go to the bathroom. I, I'm, I'm sorry, that's just hilarious. Okay, so we have just normal benches. That's fine. Let's just go some of those up. Especially around here so they can sit and hang out. While it's raining, because yeah. A litter bin. So let's fill up a lot of those. Some guests can't get to the entrance of restroom 3. Why can't they get to the entrance of restroom 3? Find out. Uh, so let's delete restroom 3, demolish it. That's fine. Oh, uh, there is a bench in the wall. Or, um, yeah, there is a trash can in the way. Gotcha. Okay, so I think people are, should be a little bit happier now with all of that in there. Um, everyone loves balloons. Let's do balloons. How can you not like balloons? Okay. Let's paint up the balloons. Let's go. Yeah, black balloons. Why not? 
Okay, and we're gonna do... Oh, we need an ATM because we want to make sure everybody has money. We're not gonna be greedy, but I mean, we, we still want their money. We're just being very subtle about it. Oh, you need to be open. I'm, I know I'm gonna end up not opening things every once in a while, so if you catch that, please um, comment to let me know. So I make sure to do that on the next episode. Okay, so we have everything going good. Make sure that's good. Okay, so let's go ahead and build something new over here, shall we? Okay, so we're going to continue this over there. And yeah, you guys can go ahead and start walking down here if you feel inclined to do so. And I don't want to make another coaster. We do have one right now. We want to save our money as much as we can. Um, we already have the pipe pipe for us, so we're good there. Um, oak barrel ride. Okay, so cast away. That's going to cost pretty much the rest of our money, but we can probably make something a little bit cheaper, so let's do that. Oh god, so now you get to learn, or you get to see my horrible building skills. I'm very imaginative with this, it's great. Okay, so we're going to build it a little bit out, so that way it allows us to have multiple different cards. So that is good. So we're at the end of the end right here. Well, I guess some people got lazy and they just didn't want to clear out all the trees, and so maybe it was here for... Ambiance. But you know, I don't want people to know that they're in the middle of a forest. When they're in here, you're being transported there. Somewhere relaxing and... That's going to be a lot of, uh... Changing of scenery, but it's... We still want the forest away from us as much as possible. Okay, so we don't want that. Ooh. Okay, it's going to start with them going through some waterfall. Okay, so we have some rapids. Yeah, why not? Yeah, that's kind of pointless to have the rapids there, but <laughs> that works. Uh, two houses, of course, gotcha. That's fine. Okay, so we're gonna build this up to that. And then we're gonna get some speed going here. And right after that speed, let's go out some rapids. There we go, that's good. And we're gonna have to do that for Yeah. Um, back to the vehicle, let's go water. Okay, so we'll go to my waterfalls. Okay, and we're going to go all the way down. Okay, so we're going to go all the way down. And there we go, we're being very lenient on space here. That's fine. Let's go more rapids. Oh, yeah, uh, tons of rapids right there. And go straight in the more rapid pond. Okay, we're gonna add more vehicles. One more for good taste. And we'll go back. Okay, so that's fairly simple, but I think it will go over well. Okay, so there's another entrance right here. Now the entrance right here, and then the exit here. Yeah, I like that. Okay, so let's test it. 
Whoa, that is a lot of cards. Do we want that many cards? Um, no, we don't need that many. Let's go 10. That feels like it would be a lot better. So let's close it and then test it again. We'll see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Oh, I want 10 cards. Oh, it might be close first. That's it. And then nothing. Okay, there we go, guys. Oak Barrel Ride 1. Um, let's change that name. It doesn't sound fun. Let's go. Pilgrims. Rapids. Oak Doom. Yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> You guys have better names for anything, let me know and I'll be more than happy to change it. Okay, so let's go to Ratch the Drag. And we don't want. Oh, we can't maximize. I know on uh, Relic Rush of Tycoon 3, we're able to actually ride the rides, which is a cool um, concept. I mean, I can. Maybe if you guys like this, I can play Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. I just really wanted to play more of the classic one, because I did play Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 a lot when I was younger, but this is what I started with, and it's, besides Pokemon, this is one of the games that really got me into being a gamer, I think. Just the concept of building something from scratch, you know, it, it made me... It's one of the first games I was really into achievements, besides Pokemon, of course. And I, I, I'm pretty sure I've beaten mostly all of the levels given to us. And I'm, not all of them, I don't think, like some of the expansions I didn't do, but all of the originals I'm for sure on this one. I know the first one I, I did as well. Okay, this looks kind of cool. This might be a little bit too many rapids right here, but you know what? That's fine. People, I'm sure, will enjoy it. Okay, and then take it. We're going to keep that at $2. That sounds reasonable. Okay, so let's go green, make it different. Okay, so we're just going to make this fairly long. Okay, so, eh, that doesn't like it. I don't like how that looks. So a little bit longer. So let's check this out here. There we go. And I don't know what that green for. Is it supposed to like make you feel like you're not on road or on um, the sidewalk? I guess I don't know. Um, okay, let's change the colors. Obviously, alternate color one. Okay, we're gonna close. Mm -hmm. Let's go jungle entrance again. The main color scheme will be red and black. There we go. Yeah, red and black I'm probably just going to be the theme on everywhere because why not? It's a cool color combination. Um. I might want black and red though. Yeah, let's see that looks. That looks perfect. And let's open this up. And there we go. Um, let's play music. Water style. Yeah, that's good. I like that. Okay, so we are still at year one. Um, can we see overall ticket sales? Money, income, income from emissions. I don't want to know that. Do I have to look at every ride individually? Okay, so total profit is only four dollars so far. Six bucks, so it's jacking up pretty fast. Um, we have three hundred and forty-three guests, so that's good. I'm not sure where I 
think she yelled at them. Um, overall, I'll take it for, you know, sounds great. That's fine. Um, oh, there we go. Right ticket, so 407, so not horrible, but not bad. Okay, overall, um, <laughs> money though is not looking so hot, but that's okay. Oh, that is broken down. Are you going? Is someone going? I hope. Uh, while well, that's happening, we might need some street lamps. So we're just gonna go those out here. Like so, there we go. That's good for me. Um, little bins. Okay. Here, in case someone throws up for some odd reason, let's throw another sheet there. And. I might want something over here. I don't think I want trees. Ooh, there we go. Yeah, for the water thing, that works perfectly, I think. We're probably wasting money right now, but that's okay. Oh. Okay. We have to really wait until we get more money <laughs> before we can do that. Oh, new attraction. There we go around. Sweet. Okay. So I think we might end it here, um, since we don't really have any money to do anything at the moment. So what I would do is I would start the next episode with a little bit more um, currency. I would just let it play through for a little bit. Um, I think we can make time go by faster to um, believe. Park rating is 764, so I believe that's good. But yeah, um, thank you guys so much for watching, I do appreciate it. If you like this uh, retro run, uh, run through, then please like and comment. Like I said, you can comment with names for all of the different rides and attractions and even the park name if you want to change it. And I'd be more than happy to oblige. And if I see a consistent number of likes, so let's say like 20% of the view, so um, yeah, depending on the total view, um, people that viewed it, if 20% of, no, let's go 10%, 10% of that, of uh, those people like it, then I will go ahead and continue making Let's Plays of this until, um, every once in a while. So it might be like every other week, maybe once a week, depending, because I do have another Let's Play going on currently. Uh, but yeah, I, I really wanted to play this game, and I am looking forward to continuing this with you guys. So again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time.